This week, our challenge is simple. We've got to find our way out of the maze. Do you think we'll get it done by the end of the show? I hope so. So, here we are in the Longleat Hedge Maze, and all we have to do is find our way out. It can't be that difficult. OK then, let's go! So, let's see what adventures we can have in the maze, and stay with us to the end of the show for our special competition. Hey look, Ali! It's Lord Bath! Hi, Lord Bath! Well, we've met before. Hello. Hello, Lord Bath. How are you? I've just come down here to have a look and see how things are going on. How are you? We're trying to find our way out, but it's a big maze. How big is it? Oh, it's pretty large. It's um, 16,000 trees and um, it's 2.8 kilometres, I believe. It covers quite a space. Has it been here a long time and how long did it take for it to be built? We planted it in 1976 and, um, uh, well, fairly quickly it all got built. We are still waiting for it to grow to the proper height because when, when the trees were first planted, they were in that high. One could walk over them, but now they're up to two metres. Can you give us any advice on how to find our way out the maze? Ah, well, that's secret. One's supposed to spend a lot of time working out all the possibilities. That's the whole thing of planting a maze, is to get everyone lost. So if you're lost, it's worked. Lord Bath, is that the plan of the maze? Uh, this is. For my eyes only. Can we borrow your plan of the maze to help us find our way out? But it's a top secret plan. No, no, I, I'm for my eyes only. You have to try all the methods of getting out and count all the failures and then eventually you do get out, we hope. Come on, Joe, we better carry on searching. Well, have a good time and I hope you do get out. Goodbye, Lord Bath. Lost. Joe, do you think there's any scary monsters in here? Because there's lots of scary stories about labyrinths, like the Minotaur. And Medusa. But they live in labyrinths. This is a maze. They're quite different. Hmm, I wonder what he means. Mazes and labyrinths can be quite magical and mysterious. Let me just cast a spell I've been working on. <laughs> Mazes are a simple kind of puzzle where the goal is to find a path from a starting point to a finishing point. You have to choose your route carefully as they offer a choice of paths, some with many entrances and exits and lots of dead ends. Labyrinths are quite different. There is only one route through a labyrinth, one well-defined path that leads to the centre. There are no tricks to it, no dead ends or cul-de-sacs, no intersecting paths, and at the centre there may be a treasure or a monster. <laughs> wow, can we use that spell to get us out the maze? No, we'll have to find our own way out. I can hear something. It seems to be coming from around that corner. What? 
Do you think he'll be able to help us? I don't know. Why don't you ask him? No, you ask him. You ask him. You! Can I help you? We're looking for our way out of the maze. Could you help us? Oh, well, I've been cutting the maze here for six years and I still can't find my way out sometimes. There are lots of hedges here. Did it take long to cut them? Yeah, there's a lot of hedges here. It takes a long, long time. It takes about three months. But what about the way out? Well, you go down here, you turn right, and then you go round into the main spiral and take the second left. Keep going round there until you come to the bridge. Over the bridge, take a left, keep going until you come to the bridge. Well, it may be hard finding our way out of the maze, but it's really easy to find this week's activity sheet. Just click on the green download button. And now it's time for the competition. And the question is, who designed the Longleat Hedge Maze? And the possible answers are listed here. Entry details are on the Junior Rangers page on the Longleat website. Wow, that was fun. And we managed to do it all by the end of the show. But in real life, it takes a lot longer than that to find your way around the maze. So make sure you leave plenty of time. But there is another maze, and it's quite different, but great fun. Make sure that you visit King Arthur's Mirror Maze. And see if you can find the three hidden treasures. Hey Annie, do you want to go in the maze again? No Joe, I want to find out all about the butterflies. Well, could you wait for me? Because I'm going to go in again. I'll be a minute, OK? No, Joe! I hope he's back in time for the next show. Next week, I'll be visiting the Butterfly Garden to find out all about the life cycle of butterflies. And we'll keep a close eye on these chrysalises to see if they hatch out. So join us for the next show, which is next week on Wednesday, 5th of August. The Life Cycle of the Butterfly.